So where we left off, we had just beaten Calamity the giant mech and gotten out of a under-desert cave or underground cave system. So now we're on the surface again and we're going to uh, Bart's hometown. And what the hell kind of music is this? This is not my chill. Alright, so let's see. What can we find to relax with? You know what? This sounds good. So we're going to the heart of Ava. Or Ave. Ava. Yeah, but I'm not looking for something with a beat. I'm looking for something to chill and unwind with after a long week. I even have my feet up on my computer desk, leaning back in my chair, and gaming. So, oh yeah, we're in the Sand Cruiser, now we can get a good look at Welltal. Faye, I was worried about you. Doc? Oh, this little butler dude. Welcome the, to the Sand Cruiser Yggdrasil. We apologize for the earlier incident. I'm sure everyone has already had the courtesy to introduce themselves, but allow me to introduce the Sa Sand Pirates leader, Master Barth ah, Bartholomew. By the way, may I ask, young master, did you apologize to Faye? Ch what? Huh? Yeah! I told him I was wrong, right? <laughs> Just telling someone you were wrong after the event isn't going to solve everything, young master. I'm sorry I've delayed introducing myself. My name is Sigurd, the first mate of this sand cruiser. Well then, please let me know if you need anything. That's the situation. So now, forgive me, will ya? Young master, stay out of mischief. And I like how they're just dr dragging him away. Let us go and wait in our cabin until we arrive. It is well made and comfortable. Mm. What is wrong? You, you look down. No, well... Something happened? No, nothing. Faye, you are a lying little bitch. And I will pimp slap you! So let's see. Fuck, didn't want to go this way. I was trying to orient myself. So let's see, we picked up a shit ton of extra armors and extra armors plus one. So let's sell that and upgrade our own shit. Well, see if we can upgrade our own shit. It would be nice if we could. Because keeping our gears... At peak performance is important, especially late game when we get our asses handed to us. Increase response. Damn, a lot of this stuff is really good, but right now, I don't think we need anything more. The increased response would be nice. And later on, you know, I'll pick this uh, armor repairer because there's a some bitch later on that uh, really wrecks our shit when it comes to that. Because they'll just keep lowering our uh, armor until they can just really beat the living hell out of us. Shit. I need to sell stuff. Sell parts. Wow, extra armors are sold for shit. God damn it. Yeah, a uh, couple bosses in a little bit have uh, things to lower your armor and then they just beat the living fuck out of you. So having this on really helps negate uh, that kind of weakness.
damn, I need a lot more money. I thought I was doing well. I should have farmed a bit more in the underground. Well, looks like I might have to do a little bit of grinding, guys. Okay, so we want to get up to the main section, I think, right now. Yeah, there's a lot of neat uh, status effects and not direct damage attacks that happen. Later on, it will be very important that I pick up uh, anti-seals. We're almost at the hideout. We'll probably stop there for a while, get supplies and repair. Alright, show us where the hideout is. Okay, good. As long as you don't mind, then I'll do some grinding and... Fuck! The graphics are <laughs> really screwed up on the, like, dust effects, but oh well. You can see we have a giant penis cruiser. I mean sand cruiser. And here we go. We're slipping right into base. It's something to do with the emulation. I was getting a bunch of different graphical and sound issues. The black miasma. But here we go. Sand Cruiser Yggdrasil has returned. Oh shit, it, does it happen now or does it happen later? Like there's an el there's something that happens with this base, but I can't remember exactly when uh, the event happens, but it might have been really good that I picked up the uh, armor protection thing. I'll definitely slap that on Faye. But I need to get to a point where I can level or sell shit so that I will have actually enough gold to upgrade everything. Hey, there's Bart. And they let little kids right on the military vessel. Bart, good to see you. Welcome back, Bart. Welcome back. Bart, what did you bring us? Well, I got a new model gear and two people that helped out. A gear? How boring. Don't you have anything more interesting? I thought you'd say that. Look, this is Amber found in a stalactite cavern under the desert. It's rare to find one with a bug in it. Wow, thanks Bart. We've got some Amber. What's that? Let's go, we gotta show it off to everyone. We must destroy these kids. Well then, I gotta tune up my gear a little. Why don't you two go have some tea with old Mason? Thanks, old Mason. Please walk this way. Uh, I have not played Skies of Arcadia, Corn. If you get a chance, could you tell me the major difference between Black Pirates and Blue Rogues? Is it like the difference between Space Pirates and Outlaws from uh, Outlaw Star? This is the residential section. Walk this way. Nope, I'm walking this way, because I'm going to steal every fucking thing you guys have. Alright, you guys have fuck all in here. Ah, okay. My room. Enter and die. Bart, 
Fuck you, Bart! I'm taking your whip, bitch! Who's this picture of a little boy and girl? Alright, well, we stole a whip from Bart, so... Fuck that guy. Oh, fuck, I didn't want to go here. This is the dining hall. I'm sorry it's so gauche. Please take a seat. Perhaps you would like some of my famous tea, Master Fay, good doctor? I would not let you have a chance to answer, and you will drink my fucking tea. Young visitors are rare indeed. The young master must be very happy. First, things were no If things were normal, we wouldn't be living in the desert, but rather back in the royal palace. Royal palace? You mean the young one is connected to the old Fatima dynasty? Pardon? N no, I'm just a senile old man who talks too much. Pay no attention to what I just said. <laughs> but that one eye youth does have a certain bearing. Oh, oh, oh. Well spoken, sir. Awfully good of you to notice. If I may, I would like to tell you, the young gent is the last forgotten reminder of a once proud Fatima dynasty. That is, before it was destroyed by Shikhan's minions. Bartholomew Fatima. Bartholomew? Edbart? The fourth successor? I am sure they announced Bar Bartholomew died in an illness twelve years ago. Officially, yes. However, in reality, we dis we re rescued the young prince from Shikan's evil grasp. Then why must you, why must the prince ah, then why must the prince, the rightful heir, resort to piracy? Since fleeing here, we have only one wish: that the young master would grow up to be a great man. Not to reclaim the throne. That is correct. Of course, to say we have absolutely no desire to restore his rule would be a lie. We have plans for that as well. And part of those plans would include piracy? Seaton, you are a little bitch, and I will pimp slap you if you don't shut the fuck up. Both Ave and Kislev are devoted to excavating the ruins. Each country's strength is increasing daily. Even if we could get the help of all our comrades to start a revolution, the combined strength of all of us would still not be enough. We would certainly be suppressed by Shikan's guards in no time at all. We needed power. We tried excavating the ruins using the Yggdrasil, but it didn't work as well as we expected. Excavating requires tremendous amounts of time, labor, and capital. The best we can do with our sand cruiser is find small items in the sand. And the piracy? I told you, fuck off, Seton. <laughs> Regardless of who gains the runes technology, one thing is certain. Both Kislev and Ava will simply use the power to oppress the other. I agreed with the young master's idea of creating a new power to balance things out a little. I see. It is far more effective to plunder from the shadows than to excavate the technology oneself. Of course, uh, pillaging is unpardonable act. However, for Ave, for Ignis to continue like this. I'm sorry if it sounds like I'm rather self-righteous, but I am. Fuck you, Seton. 
That is something which outsiders like ourselves cannot comment upon. From what you have told me, I feel that the result of what you are doing will be good. Seeing your children here tells me that. I am very much relieved by your words. Another cup of tea? Yes, please. Thank you. You mentioned you had plans. Why have you not put them into action? With, with Miss Marjorie imprisoned, we dare not do anything. She would not happen to be Nissan's. You are well, you are well informed, my dear doctor. She is the great mother Marguerite of Nissan and the young master's cousin as well. Why would Shikhan take her captive? For the Fatima Jasper. The Fatima Jasper? That is said to show where great treasure is? My good doctor! You do know an awful lot. I am most... Seaton, you are a shady motherfucker. Let's see, you know everything about the F Fatima Dynasty. You know everything about these super elite space fucks in great suits. You know the goddamn uh, second in command of this ship. You know how to repair gears. What the fuck is with you, Seaton? But it is said to be strong enough to save our kingdom if it is ever in plight. And Marguerite has the Jasper that tells the location? Only half of it, to be precise. The young master and Miss Marguerite each have half. Only by combining the two halves will anyone know where the treasure is. What exactly is the Fatima Jasper? When you say half of the Jasper, I imagine some kind of necklace. Only the heirs to Ave and Nissan uh, know what it really looks like. I see. So that is why they have her locked up. My guess is that when they do find out, her chances of living are... Ah, I apologize. I simply... I mean... I was only supposing the worst case. Please do not take it to heart. No, it, that is a terribly realistic scenario. <laughs> what, what exactly do you mean by great treasure? Well, uh, I haven't the foggiest. The gear! He means the gear! It has to be it! Oh, young master! Are the gears alright? Yeah! <laughs> Even though they were sealed, sand's gotten into the joints. It's a pain in the neck to fix, so I'm having the crew take care of it now. My job is just to pilot them anyway. Fuck, I was mixing accents. Besides, I'm done with machine or I'm bad with machines, so they just get in the way. Young master. Anyway, what were we talking about? Whether the great treasure could be a gear. Oh yeah, you know something like that is. Drawn on the Ave picture scrolls. Picture scrolls? Whoops. Exactly, Sensei. Well, if you're interested, then let's go to the planning room. I'll show you what I mean sin since you're my special guests. That sounds interesting. And the entire t time, Faye was sitting there just jacking it because... He's like, you know what? Fuck it. I just don't give a rat's ass. What do you have here, buttfucker? <laughs> you look tired. Maybe shopping will help you up. <laughs> or cheer you up. Uh, is anyone else having stream lag issues? Ooh, fuck. Corn, Sim... Anyone else? 
Uh, are you guys having stream issues, or is it just Sensei? What's down this way? Oh, nice. World map, but, um, solo. Let's see how bad I can fuck up out here. Oh, occasional chop. Hmm. Well, guys, if it gets worse, let me know, and I can try to chop or cut stream uh, and figure it out, or we can just plow through it, since I'm just going to be doing a bit of grinding. Ah, uh -huh, you can't hit me, Tin Robot. Zero damage. Oh, it fixed itself? Hot damn. Okay, might have just been a temporary uh, hiccup. I like these tin robots. They just can't hit worth a damn. But shit, they actually got some pretty high uh, HP. Alright, fucker, take some repu. Are you dead? Yes, you are. Thank God. Smack your shit. Oh, that was some good damage, too. Oh, and Faye won't have to share any of the experience. That's gonna be nice, but what I really need is a lot of gold or shit I can sell. Let's see, 300 gold, plus uh, some AR2. Or extra armor, that's not bad. Let's see, I don't think there's anything I can loot on the world map, so... Time to just get into a fight around here. Get at least enough money to where... I'll be able to upgrade well tall. I'm not too worried about Brigadier, but I should probably keep him pretty up to snuff as well. Oh, these little sand people. It's funny, the bullets of the sand people can do more damage than this giant gear jumping on top of me. So Sensei, how are you doing, man? Mac. God, think how horrible it would be to die this way. Just a giant robot slamming his fist down on top of you. Oh, nice, Sensei. That's always a great feeling when you have a place to yourself. Don't have to share shit with anyone. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. I got... Wait Have I learned a new death blow as well? Not yet. Fuck. I need to figure out how to do Hagen and Hoten. But I think they're behind level barriers? I at least have Sorentsu, so that's a good starting point. Okay, so that's the way outside. I 
Yeah, it is a really terrifying idea, or thought, isn't it? But I think the way I would not want to die would either be drowning and or burning alive. Both of those options are not pleasant to me. That'd be the worst way to go in my opinion. This place is incredible. They probably do not even have equipment like this in the capital. <laughs> Surprised? All this technology is thanks to SIG. Hey, Faye, don't stand on the screen. We won't be able to see. All right, men. Display my special file on the main screen. What is this? A picture scroll nearly 500 years old. This is King Fatima, uh, the first. Body cloaked in flames, making a blood oath with giants. They say he used the strength of the giants to found Ava. It is amazing such an ancient scroll exists, and in such good state, too. I thought the ethos controlled all such of these things. Normally, yes. But this was one of my father's prized possessions. Next. After founding the country, Fatima forced the giants into slumber to protect his kingdom's people if needed in the future. But we don't know where they were hidden. In another record, one of the, one of the giants is called the Great Fatima Treasure. What about the Jasper? Hey, you sure know a lot. Perhaps you're one of Shikan's spies. Of course not. It's only an intellectual interest. What the hell did Corn just link? Jesus Christ! I kind of wish that thing had actual fangs and just fucked that person's hand up. Just kidding. It appears that Jasper is the key to finding our treasure. A key? Could be what Shikan is looking for. Not just him. Gebler is also looking for it. Really? Then we must rescue Marguerite as soon as possible. You're telling me. Since we helped you, I was wondering if I could, uh, in turn, ask you a favor. Helped us. <laughs> you helped us by blowing up the fucking ship we were on, sinking it in sand, and nearly killing us. Yeah, yeah but we owe you a favor. Good job, Bart. You ham-fisted cock-knuckle. You know what? Whatever. Well, if it pays for my room and board... Then I will help in any way I can. What do you think, Faye? You have not said anything for a while. Yeah. You were great back there in that stalactite cavern. Your strength alone is greater than 10 or 20 of Shakan's guards. I'd love to have your power on my side. Why does everyone want to make me fight? Huh? What's with you all of a sudden? Faye? I just don't... feel like... or whoops, that was Bart's voice. I just don't feel like it. Love to have my power? I don't have any. What's wrong with you? Doc? Everyone! You're driving me to the brink. Then there's that gear, graph, and my fault. I don't even have time to help you out with your problems when I've got enough of my own. Fuck you all, I'm going home. Oh, wait. I nuked my home. God damn it! <laughs> no, that is not it. I am sorry. 
Things have happened so fast that he has not had time to deal with it all yet. Try to understand. We're gonna help service gears now. Yeah! Let's go. Kids, I will cunt punch you off the deck. Rawr. Oh, I couldn't jump down and meet them. You know what? Time to go out. Do some fighting. Well, let's say first, just in case I come across something that really wrecks my shit up. Alright, is it going to be big or is it going to be small? It's going to be big. Call gear, and I just fly into the sky as Welltall comes to fuck bitches and take names. Look at that, zero damage from getting jumped on, but I take one damage from pistol. Explain how that works. Oh well, at least I'm getting some good XP and uh, gold from this, which I really desperately need. Death. Sandman. Wait, is there no way to get out of my gear once I'm inside of it? Looks like no. Okay. Time to just punch people in the face because <laughs> I hate them. Oh, that's still a horrible way to go. Just squashed to death by a giant robot fist. Bap. Bap. Die, sand people, die! I will have to go and refuel in a bit. And then I'll make some purchase purchases to help upgrade Welltall. Because we need him to be in peak condition. Oh Jesus, Hobbs. This is overkill. Can I at least leave my gear to attack them? Really, I can't. That just seems so lame. I can summon the gear and get inside, but I just can't hop out and beat the shit out of innocent critters. All right, gear. Fuck, wrong button. Walk. Okay, so now that we're on green shit, we should be able to just fight regular enemies. And I'm removing frame limiter. We must learn Hoten, or Hagen, whatever the hell this ability's name is. I wish I remember what the actual input was to uh, master it. It was either triangle, uh, circle, or circle triangle. I don't know, maybe if I just go up here, skills. Well, I'm getting closer to figuring out whatever the hell it is. And those hobs are giving me jerky. Mmm, hob jerky. Maybe Hawken doesn't, or Hoten doesn't unlock until I'm level... Oh wait, I am level 20. Ah, there's Hagen. 
Alright, let's get into a fight and see what Hoggins like. Okay, so Hagen is triangle square. That's what we need to do first. Ooh, got some fencing wear, so that's good. Come on, get into more fights. Because I'm pretty sure I'm underleveled and definitely underfunded at this point in the game. Alright, Hoggin! Bam, 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 bam! Somersault! Fuck you, laws of physics. I don't need to obey you. I'm stomping down on someone, but it has enough force to raise them into the air. Okay, those guys were actually worth nothing at all. Time to go back into Welltal and fuck up the giant other mechs in the desert. Aw, oh, damn it. I only got 2,000 monies. Lame. Alright, time to save. Remove frame limiter. And fuck shit up. God, why is it that the giant robot can't hurt me, but these little pistols can? Makes no goddamn sense. like a handgun bullet being able to take down a titan. That shit should not be happening. Oh shit, I can go up to level 2 combos now. That's nice. Hazen, go! Good, another level. Good shit to sell, 300 gold. Okay, after this I will need to uh, go and fuel up. Time to smack all you little bitches. Okay, we need to go back to Bart Slayer. Oh, Sand Sharks. Yeah, I'll stomp on you guys. Alright, so we're going in, coming down here. We need to get back on the Yggdrasil. God damn it! Can I have a second? Mm, sure. Seaton told me all about your story. Do you want to talk about it? Why didn't you tell me? It sounds pretty rough. I am going to murder you, Bart. When your back is turned, I will kill you. Listen, I'm sorry for being a jerk just now. Forgive me, will ya? Whoa! Anyway, sorry to bring it up again, but... No. What? I don't like fighting like you do. I only got into that gear because I had to. I'd rather not ride them. If you want that gear so much, you can have it. I don't want it. 
You think I like fighting? Is that it? Don't you? Sure looks that way. It looks like the only thing you do enjoy is fighting. I can't let that slide. Who likes fighting? Take it back. Like it or not, I have to fight because... Er, I fight because I have to. I got my reasons, but you wouldn't understand. You know what? Whip your dick out right here. We're going to measure. Well, I don't have a reason... Er, I don't have a reason to fight. I don't want to fight. I just want to live in peace and quiet. But you people keep on hounding me to get into a gear. Why don't you just leave me alone? It's because I see your skill, and I think... Well, I hate it. Whatever, whenever I get in a gear, people get hurt. Like the sand people I was just punching into the bloodied sand. If I fight, people die. I don't want to hurt people. I don't want anyone to die. I hate it. Can't you see that? Yeah. I know the feeling of just wanting to run away from reality. But do you think the kids left behind in your village would understand? Seaton told me what happened in Lahan. Would it have been better if you had done nothing? Sure. That happened because you were in the gear. But even if you hadn't, people would have died, right? You weren't the reason. War? No. The people who started the war are the reason. And unless you get rid of the reason, nothing will change. I fight to get rid of the reason. Right now, there is no other way, so I have to fight. But that doesn't mean I enjoy it. I understand why you feel guilt towards the kids in your village. I know why you don't want to harm others. But if you want to make it up to those children, don't you have to fight? You do have a reason to fight. <laughs> a reason you must fight. But as long as you ignore it and continue to run away, those kids will never forgive you. Just remember that. And another thing, fuck off. <laughs> I'm not saying that not helping me is running away. You don't have to help. This is my own problem. I don't want to get you in against your will. But if I had your skill, I could bring all of this to an end. And make it up to those kids. At least, that's what I think. But you know what? Fuck off. I'm going to get wasted. Get some hookers and some titties. Fuck off. I think it would have been better if Bart would have just told off Faye. But, oh well, we don't get that. Only if I narrate it will it happen. Alright, let's go down, upgrade our shit. jump all right let's see where do we go what do you want to do with your gear i want to upgrade well tell you some bitch whoops no we don't want to fuel it up engine yes frame yes Don't... Oh, wait. Is that equipped? I don't know. You got a problem with what I just said, Corn? Really? The extra armors only get sold for... Fucking... God damn, that... Fuck the AC unit. We're keeping armor repair, that's for goddamn sure. I 
Okay, what do we have? Let's see, we can't upgrade that. Can't upgrade that. Can't upgrade that. Fantastic. We need to go out and get some more... Uh, gold and shit to kill. And besides, Corn, I really think it's within... Uh, Bart's character to say something like that. I'm going out to get some hookers and titties. Fuck you, Faye. You've pissed me off. Alright. Up the ladder. We're going to leave this section and... Go back outside to fuck shit up? Then again, it would be nice to get Seaton and Bart some experience, too. Ah, fuck. Alright, where the hell are these guys? Let's progress the story just a little bit to where we get... Uh, Seaton and Bart back. And then we'll go around the desert causing... Mayhem and destruction. We will stain the sands red with the blood of our enemies. Master Fla Faye, please relax. Go fuck yourself, Mason. Okay, that's the way out. This is the... Special room? Nope. The dude room. The barracks. No want that, so... Maybe this way. Unless everyone's back on the fucking... Uh... Oh, wait. There we go. Faye, there is no need to be mad at Bart. Just forgive him. What do you want to know? I don't want to know anything. Fuck up. Fuck off, Sigurd. God damn it. Where the hell is Bart? Bart. He's either in his room or probably on the bridge of his ship. No, we're gonna enter. Fuck the sign. Okay, Bart's not here. Bart's somewhere. Fuck, I don't even know where he is because I've been up here. So he must be down below somewhere. Yeah, we definitely need Bart to get some levels for a boss fight that's coming up in a ways. Because otherwise we'll get our ass handed to us and <laughs> fucking hate that boss. Real good reoccurring villain. Like, I like the boss that we're going to be up against, but... Uh, just the way the boss fights is infuriating at times. Off your butts, get back to work. Go down to gear hanger. Okay, so that's the back of Welltall. God damn it. This is the only thing I can do in this section. Yep, fuck. Alright, back up the stupid lift then. Ah, oh, shit. I always hate it when they don't give you an idea of where the next trigger is for the next scene. It's like, okay, I know I have to find Bart, but no idea where that son of a bitch is. Let's check the bridge of the ship. This is not that way. He's not up there. Did you hear anything about it? Yep. Oh no, don't tell anyone. Don't even know what the hell that dude's talking about or afraid of. 
All right, here we go. On to the bridge. And the only one on the bridge is fucking Penguin Franz. Hey, you fucking penguin. Or dolphin. Oh, sorry, I didn't realize that you were there. Want to hear some hot sounds that I've recorded? Sure. France collection number 45. I didn't hear shit. No, enough already. Fuck you, friends. I will drown you in mayo and make you into a sandwich. <coughs> it's a dolphin penguin, it really is. His name is Franz, or Franz, and he's in a onesie. And where the fuck is Bart? God fucking damn it. Let's see, this is a guest room? N nope. It might be in the engine room. I think I get to the engine room from here. Nope. Once again, final checks, every second counts, blah, blah, blah. Oh! So that's how they lost their eyes. Uh, there was an engine issue, and Bart ran in to try and protect the, or try to fix the thing. It blew up and took his eye out. And look! Oh, we got a doggy! We got a doggy in a little service vest. Okay, this engine crew is A-OK -okay in my book. But now, where in the fuck is Bart? And there's no other place. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm gonna try the different rooms in this area. Or maybe check out his gear in the hangar. Let's see, this is the nurse. If they had a nurse, the nurse would be here. Crew quarters? No one's here because they're all fuck off in the main base. This is going to be someone's room later on. Okay. This is the only place that goddamn Bart can be. Fuck you, Bart. Hovering is all the rage. Who wants a mecha that can hover? I mean, honestly. That just seems really dumb. Oh, where the fuck am I? Okay. Let's find Brigadier. Brigadier's not on this side. Great. Brigadier is not here either. Neither is goddamn well tall. So where in the fuck is everyone? Alright. Could leave this place and try to find the damn... Young Master so we can progress this fucking story. The tree was playing when the young master was born. It grew along with the young master. With it, our hopes and dreams grow to fruition. Anyhow, the door next to you... Blah, blah, blah. Okay.
I don't care. Shut up. <laughs> okay, one more peek in here. Is Bart around? He is not. Fuck. Alright, he must be in the base somewhere. Time to leave. Okay, he's not on this level anymore. So let me go up. Alright, where the fuck could he be? Like, really, this takes me out. Okay, so world map. Nope. He doesn't want us... Or we won't find Bart on the world map. Can I at least take a nap in this area? Okay, there's the nurse. You know, maybe if I rest, some shit will go down. Is shit going down? No shit is not going down, motherfucker. Hmm. So resting didn't progress the story. Trying to reach the world map didn't progress the story. Guess I need to find Bart and just talk to that fucker. Just forgive him! No shit! I need to forgive him! But where the fuck is he? Let's see, the knob gobbler isn't in his own room. Because we already stole everything from his fucking room. where fucking Mason is. Okay, this is the girl's dad. Welcome home, daddy. There, there. You have been a good girl obeying the nice lady? Yes. I was good, so where are my presents? Oh, look. Here's a pirate dress-up kit. Wow, thanks, dad. Mason, where the hell is your son of a bitch? Uh, young master. Okay, well, that was a nice little touching scene. But, doesn't help me with, uh, Fucking Bart. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, can't buy anything over here because god damn too expensive. Yeah, I just don't know where the hell Bart is to uh, progress the story. <laughs> That's my main problem. So I've gone around this place multiple times. So he's not on the floor. Where the hell could he be? Because I know he... He has to be around the uh, Yggdrasil somewhere. Because he's nowhere up here. Talking to Seton and Sigurd and uh, Mason didn't help. He wasn't in the engine room or the hangar. Let's see, we had a little had the little quarrel here and then he went around this way, so current supply status, forty percent. Can't jump down there, so he has to be down here. So somewhere around here must be Bart tending to the gears. So there's Welltall. Someone really knew how to tune up your gear and shit. Okay. Okay, black boxes, blah, blah, blah. There's a bunch of unknown machines on your machine. That do shit. Did I really have to just talk to my gear? Before I could... Yep. This is what I had to do. We would like to have a word with you. No, oh, okay. Have your words, bitches. You know, you guys could have brought this whole situation up when I talked to you in the command room and not going all the way down to speak to Welltall. Look over there. No, you can't make me. Hey, Dad. Can you hear me? Ever since I first looked in Faye's eyes, I knew he was a gay. He's the same as me. He understands me. Or so I thought. Did I just imagine it? Oh, I have no confidence. If I follow after you, Dad, I'll just be like I'm some decoration. At the moment, I can't even carry out your will, let alone rescue Margie. I told him he was only running away, but I'm really the one who wants to run away. The young master asked me to apologize to you. Pretty strange, huh? He knows it's best to apologize in person, but the young master isn't all that good at this sort of thing. He may not look like it, but he's really quite lonely. He's always searching for a friend. We, his minders, can't become his friends. Even if we wanted to, he just wouldn't see us that way. He knows that. Why, you ask? It's because of the burden that he bears. It must be difficult for one so young to carry so heavy a responsibility. But he does try to do his best, you know? And that's why we stick by him. It has nothing to do with him being the prince. Faye, I sense you too carry a heavy burden. This might be a selfish request, but would it be possible for you to help the young master? I'm not asking you to burden yourself with his problems or responsibilities. But could you two, uh, with whatever it is only you two 
You two each know. Help the other, please. Nope. Fuck you guys. I'm sorry. I need time to think. Of course, take your time. It's completely up to you. Whatever you decide, we will be leaving early tomorrow morning. After you're finished preparing for tomorrow, you should probably get some rest. You can use the bedroom in the residential area above. I wish to speak to Sigurd some more, so you go ahead and get some rest. This sounds like code for get ready for a fight. So I want to get ready for a fight. And I'm pretty sure it's going to be a gear fight. But I'm not sure it happens so soon. I thought it happens later. The fight in here. Fuck. It's been so long, I can't remember all the details. Alright. But I know this lady will at least allow me to equip and repair my gears. Uh, gear parts. Brigandier. Tune up. Armor. Okay, he's got that armor up. That's actually weaker. Right? Yeah. Engine. I think he has the better shit already. Okay, good enough. You know what? I'll make two uh, save states right now. One here, and one in slot two. And then I can just use slot one to grind uh, later on. Because I think after this... Uh... Rest, we'll do a quick boss fight. Did you forget anything? I'm okay. Okay, sleep well. Yeah, this definitely seems like... Shit's gonna go down. Enjoy. Um, so very tired. Blap. Okay, I did make the right call. Wow. <coughs> alarm, alarm. Pri Primi ah, perimeter has been breached. Fuck the scramble jets. Confirmed. It's their base, all right. <laughs> that rock was easy to break through. I thought it would be a little harder. Fuck. There's too many people. I am not doing voices for all these bitches. These surface-dwelling lambs sure live in a nice place. Look at that. They built this place far better than the facilities at Bledovic. It's probably a hidden fort built uh, when their old king was still around. And they're doing this with giant gears and they're super quiet. Who cares? Let's just get it over and done with. So where are the gears? Is no one on guard duty that can hear brr, brr, brr. Over here? To the right, there's a hangar. There is a hangar. Oh, just worthless pirates. Found them. These are dare mods. They're standard pirate gears. Ignore those. We can take them out fast. Why not take a few? Even if we're only 
uh, get those, it was worth sneaking it. Alright. What is that? Shaparial? Shaparial is now in place at the back. Get ready to take out anything that gets in our way. Prep complete. Okay, over here. Any time is fine. Go! Let's fuck shit up. So it's one of these guys, Corn, that I bought that uh, defense against armor down. Because he does a massive armor down attack that sucks. Gears have entered Yggdrasil Dock. Five Gebler Special Forces. All pilots report to Gear Hanger. You fuckers, don't run back and forth. Get to the hangar. Yeah, my first playthrough, I really didn't prepare for anything or look at all those nifty little side uh, add-ons for equipment and I would just get my ass handed to me on a regular basis. All non-combatants to the Yggdrasil immediately! Wah, I'm scared! To the gear hangar! Oh no no, we're just gonna calmly walk on top of the bridge and then watch the giant fight. Faye, quick, get down to Welltull now. No. Bart and the others are already fighting. Aren't you going to do anything? Do you still think it has nothing to do with you? Alright, fuck your shit, Faye. You pansy. Let me know when you have your balls back. I... I what am I? That old man, he called me the Slayer of God. I don't want that kind of power. But people are dying all around you. And you're doing nothing. Man up and protect people. How many gears are there? I don't think I took out mo or I think I took out most of the small fry, but there are at least four or five of them left. Their performance and technique is far greater than any of the ones we have faced before. Damn it. Young master, they're approaching. Hey, buddy. Suck on low accuracy. <laughs> oh, jeez. Look at how useful our second in commands are. No damage. No damage. Alright, Bart. Fuck him up. Yeah! Enjoy that accuracy down sand attack. These guys are just cannon fodder. Chain whip. Oh no, he hit for 60 some. Why do I even bother attacking with these guys? They just suck. I mean, holy damn. Alright, let's do some combos and dead. So that's one down. Four or five more to go. Alright, another level. Ooh, extra armor plus two. That's some good shit.
Mason, does this gear work? Pardon? It, yes, it, it works, but... All right. All right, now we get to see motherfucking Satan in a gear. It's fine, he'll be okay. It may not even be enough for him. Master Sigurd? So, our doctor knows just about everything in the world, can repair technology, and has and has the ability to pilot mechs. <coughs> well, it has been five years since I last fought. I hope I can still remember- I'm going to destroy everyone. Oh, a wild stallion, eh? Well then, it's high time someone broke you in. Did I accidentally remove frame limit or no? Just is moving really fast. Here, God damn it. So apparently the one uh mech that the armor protection thing works for, I don't have to fight with Faye. Because it's this fucker right here that does the armor down. I cannot allow people like you to persist in tormenting those who cannot fight back. I will take you on in their place. What are you talking about? What do we have here anyways for? Nope. Okay. Fuck you, I will kick your ass. So yeah, right here, Pile Driver weakens uh, the armor considerably, and he loves using that attack. But I didn't have access to this mech, so I couldn't equip Seaton with it at all. Aegis Knight, Pile Driver, weak in armor. Suck on some Kentsui. Dead. Suck on my balls, says Seaton. Yes, more levels. Ooh. And he either learned a new magic attack or death blow. Either would be really nice. I know I'm a little rusty. There is a limit to what I can learn, seeing as I started so late in life. Even so, I hit that guy hard and he did not go down. They must be using that stuff. Young one, they are using drive. They are battle enhancement drugs. Normal attacks will not hurt them. Are you serious? So that's how they keep at it, huh? Crap, this will never end. Faye! It's okay, we'll get by without him. Battle! And in the future against these fuckers, uh, if I get a beam coat or like a seal something, uh, I can negate a lot of these fuckers' damage, but they hurt a lot. So it's always good to just focus on one and beat the living hell out of it. To drop it ASAP. Because when they get low, they can have an attack that drops like a quarter of our health. So fuck you! Eat the chain whip. Yeah, right here. Power beam. It hurts. And they'll use it every turn once they get below a certain point of uh, health. And dead. Good. To hell with you little bitches. Ooh. That's three extra armors plus two. Someone's gonna get a tank mech. Sis! Where do you think you're going? I'm gonna fist you with my claws. 
How admirable. Now what kind of sound will you make when I squish you? What? Why are you fighting? You, what are you doing? What does fighting get you? What if this was your home? What do I even have anyways? Restores gear defense and large chi attack. Nothing really worth it. So, we smack you around. How's it going, Dolan? Smack this guy twice in the face. And level 2 combo should hopefully kill him. Yes! Yay, more levels! Well, that's shitty, Dolan. Sorry to hear it. I knew you'd come around. We'll talk later, we've got big trouble coming at us. <laughs> Look at this dopey motherfucker. Sucky sucky five dollar? <laughs> Alright, so let's see. Ether machine. Renki. Oh sweet, that... This is an awesome ability that uh, Seaton has. His next ether attack will affect everything, so it's an AoE heal or an AoE attack for magic later in game. Alright, so Faye, you just beat the hell out of this thing. We'll have Bart lower its uh, fucking accuracy. Wild smile, go! Whoops. Hit the wrong goddamn button. Seaton should have used a combo attack. <laughs> Miss you, fucker. You know what? We're gonna do it again. To make sure you keep missing. Your drill cannot even pierce the heavens. You fail and lose. Alright, there we go. Now this is some suitable damage on this bitch. Ooh, 600. Nice. Wild Smile can be such a broken ability when it's uh, used properly. Really, Dolan? It's porn? Uh, I couldn't figure that out just by reading the tags. Defense down. How about you just get your shit slapped by three gears? Okay, this... Granted, this motherfucker does have some high HP. But you will miss, sucker! Defense down. <laughs> yeah, defense down us all you want. It does nothing if you can't hit us. There we go. Fuck your couch. Yeah. 
Yes, beam coat. That is one thing I need to keep for a while. Hey, Dolan. Guess what? Th th thank you. Thanks, Faye. Bart. Shepard. Rex. Thank you, Faye. Don't know how uh, we could have done it without you. I still don't know what I should do. Uh, that was a boss fight, and I've been streaming for about... Uh, what is it? About an hour and a half. So, uh, Marco. Agreed. Guess what could be either good or bad? But in this case, it's me ending stream because I've been streaming for a while. 